Okay guys, welcome back to Battlefield Hardline. Let's uh, go ahead and start episode three. And again, as usual, I just want to thank you for your support and let you know how much it means to me guys that you guys like to watch my videos. And uh, I'm gonna try to do a little bit better. And I don't think I've died yet. I might have, I'm not sure, but I'm gonna try to do a little bit better this time with switching up the guns. You wanted to see me, sir? And also have a seat? Let's change things up for you, too. Relax. He's not gonna make you direct traffic. Well, not yet. So, Leo, our good friend, he told us what he knew and he walked right out the door. He came in for protection, I thought. Tell Nick what Leo gave up. Drug bails. You're shitting me. Planes go up. Drugs come down. Plop. Right into the Everglades. Show them. A fishing map. Whose operation is this? Some ship bird named Remy Neltz. Two years ago, this Neltz character was nothing. A blip on the radar. Now, he runs the entire operation that employed Tyson Latchford. Sounds like a man of ambition. Yes, he does. I want you two to wade into that mud hole we call a national park and find out just how ambitious he is. Sir, why would Leo rat on his boss and then just walk out into the open? Well, Leo said he didn't feel safe around cops anymore. We're done. Actually, Mendoza, stay a minute. Of course. Your partner can be a bit of a hothead. Well, she believes in what she's doing, sir. Good answer. Sit down, son. There are going to be some complaints about the Elmore. Excessive force, etc., etc. Don't worry about it. I'll handle it. Well, we appreciate that. Mm. Thank you, sir. Always got to be some past the furious dude driving by my house when I'm recording things. Oh, yes, <laughs> your mother? I'm sure she went through a lot to get you out of Cuba. You don't become a detective, especially at your age, without a thorough background check. And you have a lot of background to check. Sir, it's all right. I know what it's like to have a shithead for a father, too. It took me a long time to find my way. And you? You're on the right path, son. Stay on it. Okay, guys. Jesus Welcome back. Jesus Christ, Leo's map is confusing. The scale is all wrong, but I think this is it. Leo just gave Dawes that map. Just handed it over. Handed over an unbelievably shitty map. Yeah, but what's in it for him? That's what I don't understand. Well, he's obviously being pressured by someone or something. Whoever's dropping these bales, Leo wants us to know about it. So we can take out his competition, right? Leo knows he's done in Miami. I had to guess he's probably setting up a meth lab in Iowa right about now. What the hell were you thinking anyway, beating him up like that? If Leo had an attitude problem. And we could have had an internal affairs problem. We got him sweating. There's our girl. Take us toward the drop. They're in the Everglades, so obviously Narcos it's pretty damn hot. Narcos bales by radio. The number on Leo's map must be the frequency. And look at that. We got a pig. Get me close enough to a bale and I'll tag it with a tracking dart. That way when someone comes to pick these things up, we'll know exactly where they go. You know, back when the cartels ran their drugs through Miami, these swamps were filled with smugglers. Maybe history's oh, repeating you. itself. Let's hope not. Back then, cartel guys were gunning each other down at their kids' birthday parties. Yeah, I remember. Look I was at just that. a kid Alligator, baby. I saw some crazy shit. Blood on the sidewalk. Pit bulls with your throat slashed. How the hell did your mom keep you out of all that shit? Well, it's gonna sound a little corny. She worked hard. And she loved me. Yeah, that sounds pretty goddamn boring. I'm on this point. <laughs> Never would have guessed. 
Tagged it. Got now let's person. see where it goes. And we got another pig. Lead on, okay. partner. At least 10 kilos in that bale. Americans love their drugs. My point is, this is not a small operation. Dawes wouldn't have us out here if it was. So say the cartels are using Miami to move product again. Why would they do that? My best guess? Mexico's gotten way too scary. The average smuggler will risk prison but not having his head chopped off by some Zeta. <laughs> Americans do love their drugs. Hey. It's a big deal that Dawes put us on this, you know that, right? Oh, I know. The problem is, the stuff we're doing, we can't exactly bring to a DA. Who gives a shit? This is way more fun. Look at that, guys. It's a crashed plane. Huh, it's weird. Weird that it would, they would just leave it out here like that, but... You would think there'd be some kind of recovery or... something going on. Got the second one. By the way, Captain Dawes, that guy was reckless as hell when he was young. Yeah, I heard that about him. It's just a risky way to work, that's all. Word of advice. You want to get on the captain's good side? Take the gloves off. Well, got some SMG guns there. knuckle police work? Now you're catching on. Yeah, uh, this video probably won't have too much of me talking in it, guys, because, uh, there's a lot of dialogue in this episode from what I can tell so far. Okay, stop at a dock. Disembark. The okay. The near that parachute. Okay, I'll pull up to the dock. Oh, shit, guys. A lot of gators out here. Yeah, I wouldn't sweat it. They're more afraid of us than we are of them. Okay, something tells me that ain't true, but... <laughs> Alright, guys. Okay, here's the last, uh... Last bail, I guess I just... This is not smart at all. Why the hell would anyone walk through the freaking Everglades? Just say thanks. Okay. Thanks. Maybe we should stick to the trail. I think that's a great idea, Mendoza. <laughs> More afraid of us than we are of them, huh? Let's just get out of the water. Yeah, we let's get, get out of the water. Platform. Try this grappling hook. I borrowed it from SWAT. Okay. Where? Oh, she dropped it on the ground. Okay, let me go ahead and grab that grappling hook. Ever used one before? No. Launch the hook at the platform. There we go. I'm a grappling hook master now, baby. It's all. <laughs> Uh, okay, I guess we just go down this way. I was like, do I grapple? Build these things? No. They're old observation platforms. The tourists. I ain't trusting this water right now, guys. How's your shoulder? Oh, shit. What? Hurts like hell, actually. I'm like, get me out of this water, man. Capes in the ears not Here. included. Brought a zipline right. Oh, you just brought everything, didn't you? Okay, let me go ahead and grab that zipline. <clears throat> Alrighty you then. You did come prepared. 
Yeah. Okay, you just shoot. What? Aim for the flanks. I'll make a good anchor. Bullseye. Um, okay. Where did this giant fucking Follow hole come from? And how did it get bolted to the concrete that easily? Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, shit. What's your scanner showing? Hi, we've got company. Shit. They must be the pickup crew. At least it's not a There's at least half that's still okay. I don't know, the other half's got leaves and shit in it. That's why Meltz won't mind us taking it off his hands. Hey, that's not how we do things. Yeah, who's we? Okay guys, let me go ahead and switch back to the gun here. <clears throat> or is this a stun gun? What? Yeah, I really wish there was... It'd be nice if there was some kind of like locker or something over here I could change guns with. Okay, I'm gonna arrest this dude just because he's worth a lot. Oh great, he's gotta be talking to that guy, are you kidding me? Shut up, scanner. Come on. <clears throat> Quit walking away from me, you fucking douche. Put your hands up. And don't move. For you. I'm your worst <gasps> nightmare, bitch. <laughs> yeah, there we go, baby. And I'm gonna try to arrest as many as possible. Normally, like I, I say, I'm fun and gun. I'll go in guns blazing. I don't care. But, uh, you know, you get way more points for this, and I'm, I'm really trying to get all the guns. Hold it. Don't you move. You son of a bitch. Yeah, I'm really trying to get all the guns in this game before I finish it, so. And I feel like the only way to do that. This is freaking dude. Okay. I'm trying to stay away from that dam. Okay, here we go. Police, you're under arrest. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> that beat down, son. We're clear. Hopefully, there's a weapons Looks like locker that in this thing. Was the target. Yep, here we go. Let me go ahead and change out some of this stuff. Okay, for one, I don't like that gadget, but it's the only one I got. Wait, no it isn't. What the hell is a gas mask for? Ammo box. Armored insert? Let me go ahead and get that. Whatever has the best accuracy. The MP... Ooh, the P90. Accuracy sucks, though, man. I'm getting the MPX. Check that out, see what it's like. Let me, uh... Let me see here. Really? I have nothing else unlocked? Are you, are you kidding me right now? <laughs> I was going to put a red dot sight on that shit, man. Melee is a nightstick. What else we got? Police baton. What's the difference, though? There's no... I guess there's just no difference. Okay. And I'm sticking with the 357 at the moment. I'll check that radio here when we come back. Uh, for now, I'm going to say thank you all so much for your support. When we come back, we're going to check that radio and maybe gather a little bit of evidence I might have missed. All right, guys. Peace.